Good morning, worthy women. How much do you give up? How much do you give up to be loved, to be accepted? How much of yourself do you toss aside? How much of yourself do you stop investing in? How many activities have you tossed? Have you stopped doing because you wanted someone to like you? You wanted someone to love you more. You wanted someone to feel like you were worth the investment in having a relationship with. You wanted to be picked. You wanted your husband to say that you were a good wife. You want this this man to say he wants to marry you. You want him to see that you are the one. You want him to know that you are the best one. And so you give yourself up. You stop doing the things that you like to do. You stop dressing a certain way. You tone down your lipstick. You put aside the ruby red and you start wearing nude colors you know you 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 change your work schedule you put friends aside and you do these things with the intent of being accepted and what happens is is this person doesn't get to see the genuine and, and, and authentic you they get to see this personality and this persona that you have created with the hopes of being accepted and being loved and then let's say it works. It causes discomfort because at some point, who doesn't want to be themselves? At some point, you know, you know, how ladies, we, we go out to eat. I, I, I don't do this. You go out to eat, you go to dinner with someone and you try to order a salad. No one good and well, you hungry, right? But you got to order a salad so he won't see how you really eat. <laughs> or how much you can really put away. I don't have an issue. But some of us do. And we think that, you know, well, you know, I want to be a lady, and I don't want him to see how much I grub. But it's fake. It's fake. You know you want some chicken tenders. You know, let people enjoy the authentic you, because this is what happens, ladies. You get pissed off at some point. And what do you get pissed off about? I get angry because I'm stifled because I'm not being able to be my true self and then what happens is is that the person doesn't really get to one know the real you two they don't get to enjoy the real you and now you sit here with the attitude what happens with the relationship they don't really even like you that much because you sitting here all frazzled all frustrated all fake and then we, we, we talk about men. Men, they play games. They always play games. What the hell is this? This is the problem, though. You're not playing a game with him. You're actually playing a game with yourself because this person doesn't even know this is a game. They actually think that this is who you are. You're fronting on you. How crazy is this? And you do it with the hopes, again, of being accepted and being loved and being wanted and being liked and being picked. This is the problem. Did you pick you? Did you accept you? Did you love you? Did you like you? Did you do those things for you first? before you tried to put this duty in this option or even this obligation on someone else? Just answer that. I'm gonna see you guys tonight at 8 p.m. For those of you who've done your homework assignment, I tell you I have just been so amazed at the follow through with that. Look for a response from me and we are going to keep this wonder going. But I'm gonna tell you the key to being accepted, to being wanted, to being liked, to being picked is for you to do it for you because you're going to go in so many circles where it's not going to happen. And even the people who do love you and who do like you and who do accept you, there are going to be moments when you're going to do something that they don't like, that they don't accept, that they don't think that you should choose. You want people like and
doesn't always happen though, and I know that. And if they don't, for whatever reason, people show up human, family members being manipulative, and we can keep going down the list of the reasons why this could happen. But for whatever reason, the, the thing that should remain at your core is what you do. All right, I'll see you tonight.